let's pick up from last time. Apparently, Tara's bra matches her underwear. This it, is what it does. she told me. It does. I have two pairs that match. I it. have a tan. Oh, oh I'm yeah, like, I'm like over, right I'm over here like this. Welcome to Lazy Gecko Sailing. Looking for something exciting, free, and real? If so, you found the right place. Meet Calypso, our floating home. It's not working. We're sailing her all over and taking you for the ride. Please click on subscribe so you don't miss any of the fun. We woke up this morning in some pretty heavy fog and uh, we're making our way down. I just got out of the CND Canal and making our way down towards the Chesapeake. And I'm just monitoring the radar and uh, AIS for traffic and buoys and making sure we stay in the channel while Brittany is up front because I can't really see anything. And uh, so I kind of steer the boat with the compass and the chart. So I use two different charts and you can only tell if you're turning by looking at the compass, you know? So you look at that, make sure you're uh, not turning too far. So like that. Now we're in a pretty straight area, so I'm using the autopilot, uh, but it can be a little hairy for sure. How's it going, honey? I figured I had like a minute before I had to look again. It's kind of clearing up a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, it's beautiful. She's been up there for like, uh, I don't know, an hour and a half or something like that. Maybe like an hour. Hopefully the fog burns off. It's about 8.20 in the morning right now. So hopefully it burns off by at least nine. But I do see a boat coming. So I'll make sure like, you know, they're coming behind us. So if they come up on us, I'll radio them before they get to us. And uh, just make sure they see us. And, Keep an eye out and then probably slow down and let them go by but it's kind of a tight little channel we're in luckily it's early in the morning and i don't see any uh major like ship traffic as of yet so but we're going to make our way down the chesapeake and um go to a little anchorage like halfway between the cnd and baltimore uh and just enjoy the day and you know i don't know i don't know what the heck we're going to do maybe work a little bit but we'll see Foggy day shenanigans. Cleaning the white vinyl and windows. I just cleaned the whole salon area. I'm now still working on the floors. What are you doing? Opening windows? Yeah. I'm doing it's, dishes? It's hot. I will be. It is toasty. What'd you think about that fog? Yeah, it was foggy this morning. I don't even know what to call it. It was fog. It was like a roadblock of fog. It was. It was fog. very foggy. It was okay. How'd you like it? It was fine. I mean, it's great to get more experience. I think that's the most fog we've ever been in. And I found it interesting that the Coast Guard actually closed down the canal. Yeah, yeah they shut it down. I was like, okay, well, yeah, this is definitely experience. Yeah, it was good. We only went like three hours and got into a new anchorage. It was very calm and beautiful. And I relaxed a little bit. I was tired. I, I woke up really early. Tara and I are knocking out some cleaning. What do you think of the vinyl? There's a lot of vinyl. I know, it's fun, huh? <laughs> I know, the salon's always a big one. So I vacuum the carpet, then I pull up the carpet, and I vacuum the floors, or as Tara would call it, sweeping. Yeah. She said to me one time, she goes, I'm gonna sweep the floors. I'm like, how are you gonna sweep the floors on a boat? <laughs> You're like their carpet. To me, a sweeper is like a, a vacuum. No. Oh, an actual person that sweeps? Like a, a sweet, broom. a broom. Oh yeah, that's a broom. Uh, <laughs> I guess that's what you guys say in Indiana. Yeah, that's an Indiana thing. We also say bags. Is that is that it or is it sacks? For what? Sacks. You say sacks for bags? We say both. Wow. But yeah, so like I had to really get used to when I moved to Texas and then when I moved to North Carolina to change it and say I don't need a bag because I would say I don't need a sack and they'd look at me funny. Oh. Huh, yeah, I would look at you funny too. Yeah. And we got 
The little guy digging for treasure. I found, I'm found the treasure. I'm digging it out. Oh, yeah. This is so hard to get it. It's really stuck in there. I need mommy's sharp nails help. I don't have any nails. Well, can you please dig them out? We need one of daddy's tools. That's what we need. Daddy said drilling. <laughs> <laughs> These quiet days are great for getting caught up on things like work, maintenance, and cleaning Calypso. But we always make sure to take time at sunset to celebrate the day. Are you getting the uh, footage of Jeremiah? You're messing up my and freaking... And the exploding sausages? I'm trying to, but I also heard him talking sh about me, so I wanted to oh. record no, what he's saying. How you used to record. She, well, she came out to record something, and, and then after it was done, she said, I never hit record. Yes, and that I was my mistake. And I talked about how you would, you would do the opposite. Like, you, it would be recording for whatever reason, and then you'd be like, okay, I'm gonna record, and you hit off, and then the whole event would happen, and then you hit on again, and then it would just be like the floor. <laughs> so I was the opposite of you. But you're doing good. Look at this. It takes practice. Check out the exploding sausages. These are frozen, so they're gonna flare up really good. But. Oh, it was better last time you said it. You said it was gonna go. It looks delicious. What ones good. are you eating? Exploding or not exploding? We're, we have the exploding sausages. Oh, we do. These Which are ones? the these are mine. The brats. Oh, those are you, yeah. Oh, okay. You're eating the exploding. I'm not. You oh, well, you're gonna. The you let me know how you can have a bite of my exploding one. Oh, I can have a bite of Tara's exploding <laughs> sausage. And like UPS, they guarantee on time delivery. Ooh, when's the delivery? I don't, even, I don't even know what that means. On time? You're the one delivering Overnight, it. Um, delivery. No, it's the sausage. Next day delivery. Oh, all right. Next day. <laughs> if you're Got lucky. It. What girl doesn't love next day delivery? It's the next morning and guess what? More fog. We woke up to another one and it doesn't seem to be burning off this time. What to do, what to do. been a little foggy this morning. A little? A yeah. little. There's a boat right next to us and he yeah. just now appeared. Yeah. Well, it's now, what, 11 something? Mm-hmm. That's pretty bad for me lasting this long. No, it's 12.10. Oh, is it? Yeah. Wow. Well, this is the second day of fog. Yesterday we were coming out of the C&D Canal in some heavy fog. Yeah. How do you feel about today, traveling in the fog? We're going to wait till it burns off. Okay. I think traveling is the easy part, but the problem is there's other issues out there, like a bass boat going 20 knots flying through the fog, yes. like that happened yesterday and came right in front of our bow. We will wait until this fog burns off and then we're gonna head across to go to the Inner Harbor in Baltimore. Yeah. Yay! I'm excited to go there, I've been wanting to go there. Yeah, looking forward to taking Reese to the National Aquarium. Do you have your jewels on you right now, your treasure? It's inside. Oh, man. Reese, yeah, you wanna grab that? Yeah. Reese has been working on digging treasure out. They're um, stones from right. their people. Gems. Right. Well, Gems. those stones, and then these are these are in it, and it's kind of like they have to dig it out, like it's in the dirt. Let me see. It comes in a pirate treasure chest. Yeah. Treasure oh. He tried to give me one today. It was so sweet of him, but I told him no, he can keep it. Um. He earned it. Um. I have. I have a birth sign. You have a what? I have a birthstone. What is it? It's um, it's a whitish brew cutter. Aquamarine. Aquamarine. Yeah. It's kind of fitting because he lives, right. you know, on the water. His dad's yeah. marine. Um, yeah, that's right. <laughs> this is my brother. So this is Megan, Jessica, and Trevor's. Yeah, one. who's Megan, Jessica, and Trevor? This one. Who no, are they? That's, oh. that's Jessica and Trevor's oh. color, not Megan. Oh. Um. So this one is like a whitish purple. This one's it's an black. amethyst. That's a ruby. Yeah, and this is a it's a whitish green, whitish blue mixed It's there. an emerald. Yeah. Was it fun doing that? Yeah, it was. Yeah. Um, it took so long for me to find these. Yeah, it did. But Two that's days, good. I'm glad. Right? It, I'm glad it took a little while. Two days of digging. Yeah, that's good. Now you now you're proud of it, right? Best things are. The things you work for, my man. The fog burned off enough to pull anchor. We're headed for the Inner Harbor in Baltimore, Maryland.
There she is. It's not as wet though, but it does come in the window. And I keep the window open so that I can like, just pop up, like, if I need to see something, I just come up like this. And it's getting good not to be able to see crab pots and stuff, but thanks for being up there. We're welcome, I'm gonna take a five minute break and we'll go back up. Uh, well, hopefully we won't need them. I'm just gonna stand here and watch the crab pots and stuff like that. the base of it I can see more of it over there over here you can't even really see the top at all like oh right God. in front of us it's gone yeah. kind of trippy looking yeah the fog's kind of hovering Pretty where do you cool. think the best view is of what For the camera I like if you go over here and look up there you want me to go out there into the cold wetness yeah hey, I got a well scary it's actually very beautiful so we just went with it this is the Chesapeake Bay Bridge. Well, some of it. This sucker is high. That don't make it better. taking pictures. When? Oh, before? Yeah, on the way north. Fall, winter. That was summer. Oh. We're in fall now, honey. Pulling into Baltimore was a treat. Making it even better was a personal welcome from the fire department. Thank you, boys. We're snuggling Calypso up to the dock right in the harbor where we'll explore the sites before continuing south. Locations such as the National Aquarium are cool places to visit here. No, got it. I don't like to bite it. I like to just lick it. Oh, okay. Is it cool? Do you like it? Yummy. Yeah, it's delicious. It's delicious. Weird, it's delicious. Weird kid, huh? So this is your snack tonight, huh? So you opted for this instead of Oreo cookies? Yeah. Wow. You're gonna eat a, a slice of lime? <laughs> That's he was like, yummy. He was like, what fruits do we have? He's been wanting some uh, apple, apple and peanut, peanut butter, but yeah. we're out right now. We're out of apple. So then he, he pulled out a pear, and then he pulled out a lime. So. Nice. Honey. Yes? Voice over time. Duty calls. What is this? My blanket? No, the outfit, man. You look like Madonna. What are you talking about? This is just casual dressing. Oh, that hurt. That's it's great. Not... Let me look at that. Damn, they stuff. That's hot. That's you... my style, man. I love the 80s. Yeah. Oh, look, it says I love the 80s. Yeah. Do it the does. little, can you do like the little wham dance? Yeah, kind of. <laughs> I need voiceover. I got the side hair and everything. So what is this? Did you have any hair? idea I had this outfit packed away? No, that's that's awesome. It kind of takes up a lot of space, but... Yeah, you probably take it off. It's, it's worth it. All right, we're doing a video. I need voiceover. And if you could take a break from whatever activities you're doing. I haven't even started my activities. You caught me beforehand. I am. should be great. Hopefully my butt doesn't stick to the leather now. Oh, oh, is that why you got the blanket? Yeah. I like it. How much voiceover? Oh my gosh. Yeah, just a little bit. There's a lot. A lot of voiceover. All right, well. I'm gonna have to take my hair thank off for you. this one. You're gonna have, we're next to a military base, which is cool, and they have fighters flying over. So you're gonna have to time your voice between the fighters. That's perfect. I can hear one right now. Fabulous. Yeah. Get it. And then I'll turn off the AC. Any noise, any outside noise, we'll pick up on the mic. Anything outside, horns, birds, anything. And our washer and dryer usually makes a lot of, like it can make noise. And the ice maker shows a lot. So 
But our noise pollution should be low right now. Besides the jets. Can I have my water? Because my throat gets dry when I talk. So. Where is it? Oh, yeah. I can come over here one foot from you and pick that up for you. It's not bad. No problem. It's not, I no, I know. You like to be served by, <laughs> no. your, by your man. I know. It was just hard to get in and out with the heels and the tutu. All right. Go for it. All right. Knock it out. T today, we're going to take you underwater. Today? No. Today, we're going to take you underwater. Today, we're going to take you underwater. No. Yeah, plus there's a jet. This might be really hard to do because of the jets. Pardon their noise. It's the sound of your freedom. Okay, well, when you say it like that, you make me feel really bad. I didn't mean it like that. It just meant it'd be hard to do. I have a couple seconds. Let's I think try. you're good. Today, we're going to take you underwater. Coming soon on the Lazy Geckos. And now I try to catch it. Broadcasting everybody. The Coast Guard's recording you. Everything's so... You can hold on to me if you need. That is bad. It's ridiculous. It looks like a flock of birds laying on our boat. Are you nervous? So there's mold showing up where that condensation is. Angel Oak Tree. You can still see the dark spot. We're gonna be riding in style. <laughs> they glued it in. <sighs> I'm heading to Walmart. All right, here we go. Have fun. We made it. I think it looks fine like this. We're the boat once again for a hurricane. Look at the back of this thing. I've never seen the inside of a microwave. Oops. We have Jason Pinko here today. The inner diamema is spliced into itself to so right there. Is this the best day ever? Want more? Check us out at lazygeckos.net. Remember, patrons can get complimentary access. You can also visit our Vimeo channel. The link is below. Don't forget to click subscribe to get all of the fun. See you next week.